jump on really quickly to give you a different type of workout with Calypso Kings. Uh, Calypso Kings is a static stretching workout that we like to incorporate throughout our week. We want to make sure that we're getting stretching along with our HIIT workouts um, to make sure to allow our body to function at full capacity. So there's 15 different stretches that we're going to incorporate. It's 45 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, and there's going to be two laps through. So let's get started. All right, guys, so we're starting with uh, station one, which is a seated cross leg spine stretch. So we're going to go off to our left, and we're going to pull our spine. We're going to take deep breath, get further into that stretch. Try to get a good stretch into your spine. Holding it for 45 seconds. Then we're going to go off into the next stretch, which is going to just be the opposite side going into your right. So side, seated, cross leg stretch, spine stretch to our right. Again, deep breath, getting further into that stretch. Next, we're going to go to our cross side bend to our left side. Hold that for 45 seconds again. Deep breath, breathing in, exhaling out, getting further into that stretch. Going to our right side, which is station four. Again, deep breath in, holding out further. Now we're going into station five, which is the standing glute leg release. Again, balance is going to be key here. Crossing your leg onto your knee and shooting your hips back. Holding that, you should feel it in your glute and your ham, hamstrings. <laughs> Station six is going to be your right leg, so opposite leg. Again, the more you go down into this, you're gonna feel it more into your hip or your glutes and your hamstrings. Next is the seated groin stretch. We're going to bring our legs, we're going to try to bring our, our heels in towards our pelvis as far as we can. Holding onto your feet, trying to release your legs down to the side to really feel it into your groin. Again, taking your deep breaths in, exhaling out, trying to get it further and deeper stretch. Next is going to be double leg seated hamstring stretch, going out and grabbing your toes. Taking a deep breath, trying to get further into that stretch. Next, we're going into station nine, which is the prone quad stretch. Going onto your chest, grabbing your left leg, really pulling on your, your feet to pull toward your quad. Deep breath in, exhale out. Switching into station 11, or 10, I should say, sorry. And that's gonna be your right, grabbing your right foot, bringing it in towards your butt. Deep breath in. Exhale out, getting a deeper stretch. Going into station 11, which is the pigeon, or the prone pigeon. We're just going to bring, what you're going to do is you're just going to bring your foot up, cross it underneath of you, and your other leg is shooting back. You're on your elbows. Taking a deep breath. Trying to get further into that stretch. Switching into station 12, which is bringing your right leg in. And same thing that we just did, opposite leg. Take a deep breath in, release, and then we're going into our prone chest. So we're going to go to the floor and we can either put our shoulder or arm out to the side or bring it in closer if we need to, but what we want to do is we're going to take this hand and actually kind of push towards the arm that's out, get a, a good stretch in your chest, deep breath in. Relax. Again, it's going to be 45 seconds. Switching to our right side. Same thing, shooting the arm out. If you need to bring it in closer to your body, go ahead. Good job, guys. 
Now we're going into the prone bow. So we're grabbing both of our feet towards our glutes, holding, stretching our quads, chest is off the ground. Take a deep breath in, let it out. A progression to that one is just going to be sitting on your feet, going back and stretching. You should feel it in your hamstrings, or not hamstrings, in your quads, guys. All right, and that's our Calypso workout. Have a great day.